You may have heard of the term GI cancer, but what exactly does that include? Hi, I'm Dr. Sanket Mehta, surgical oncologist. And GI stands for gastrointestinal. And GI cancers include cancers that start in the digestive system. This means esophageal cancer, which starts in the food pipe, stomach cancer, small intestine cancer, colorectal cancer, which includes the colon and the rectum, liver cancer, gallbladder cancer, pancreatic cancer, and even anal cancer. These cancers present with symptoms that are often ignored. Bloating, weight loss, change in bowel habits, blood in stools and just some vague abdominal discomfort. Some are linked to lifestyle like smoking, alcohol, processed foods or obesity. Others may be genetic or related to chronic infections like hepatitis. The key to better outcomes in GI cancers is early detection. Many patients come to us late because symptoms seem mild at first. If something feels off with your digestion, don't wait for months to get it checked. Share this with someone who keeps blaming the symptoms on gas and acidity. GI cancers don't always shout, but they do whisper early.